Welcome, welcome out to the right coast, as they say here. Right coast. Well, it depends where you're standing. Yeah. It does. What direction you're standing. Right. But we're, we're supposing if you're looking in Costa Rica, you know, looking north. Okay. All right. On the right. And is there a lot to learn for a relatively young band when you're on the road with guys like this? Yeah, well, you know, you know how to drink heavy. <laughs> <laughs> they're pros, so they, uh, they know what they're doing. But we're willing to learn, so. Yeah. Quack, quack, quack. Okay. Uh, the very first one I got was this little heart with a guitar on it. And if you notice, the guitar is left-handed, so I fucked up. <laughs> and uh, it just kind of grew. I got that, and when Randy Rhodes died, I got this blue rose. And when my cousin died, I got this purple rose over here. And then this girl bought me this my name for my birthday. And then all of a sudden, I woke up one day and went, Ah! Oh, it hurts! Hi, I'm Kelly, I'm Kelly Nichols, and I'm the bass player, and uh, see you in Tokyo, motherfucker. Good evening, my new ventriloquist dummy. Say hello to the children, everybody. Hello. How are you? How are you doing today? <laughs> oh, 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 that was on pitch, too. Nick, have you been drinking? Uh, 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 Nick, have you been drinking? Uh, has this, has this man, has this man, have you asked, you asked, you asked, we need to know, has this man, for, uh, send your post, uh, answers in on a post. It's like Andy Cat. Has this man been drinking tonight? He's just a smart bar. Yeah. 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 I had a baby in uh, Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, this young girl, uh, I don't know how young, pretty young, um, had to let me know that. Uh, this is the picture of the baby. <laughs> yeah. The baby. Two and a half months old, Jeremy Roth. Like one of your members is in Wasp, and, and your bass player was in Faster Pussycat, and That's right. there's some connection with you and L.A. and the Guns and Roses. And yeah, well, there is a connection with me and L.A. Guns too. I bet there is, and um, we'll go but, into that but, later. Now let's talk about the video that we're going to show. It's one more reason. To die. Yes. One more reason to die. In L.A. <laughs> In L.A. Right. This very suicidal video. Right. What? <laughs> Who we wrote We lost our first drummer in that video. If you see, like, at the end, he jumps off the building. That was... Well, that chick knocked him off. Yeah, that was actual footage of him falling off the building. That's why we have... You're right! <laughs> I run a lot, you know, right. and, and uh, I was usually around, you know, where we're playing the theater and, and, and a couple of kids noticed me and they were following me in their car and they crashed into a parked car. So I ran over to see if they were all right and he was okay and, and she was slumped over the dashboard and he was like pulling her out the way trying to find a pen so that he could, he could <laughs> autograph his CD. <laughs> yeah. Raised it last night, man. What was up? It was like the night before. Well, they asked us to go jam at this club, um, the China Club. And uh, when I got there, uh, Entwistle's doing my generation. <laughs> So I was like, see ya. <laughs> you know, I don't think I want to play today, man. <laughs> <You know? laughs> All the best like, musicians in the world just looking at him and, uh, you know, yeah, I'm going to go up there and like fuck up Honky Tonk Women, okay? Uh, I don't know. So I just got shit faced and depressed and, you know. <laughs> Are you feeling better? I'm working out. It's, yeah, good, good. I'm glad to hear it. Hi, this is Tracy Guns from LA Guns, and we are LA Guns, and here we are on TV. On the television. Sound Peach. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Hi, this is Kelly Nichols and Steve Riley. And we're on The Rock TV. Check it out. You didn't say the name of the band. Hi, this is Kelly Nichols of LA Guns with Steve Riley on The Rock TV. You still didn't say it. Yeah, you did. Oh, you did? Yeah. Hi, this is Phil from the LA Guns and you're watching Pop in Pop. Oh, 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 oh how was that? All right?彼たちの友達で女性なんですけど、え、マクシーさんっていうね、デザイナーの方がいるんですけど、彼女もとっても格好いい人らしいんですけどね。ごめん。ごめん。ごめん。ごめん。ごめん。ごめん。ごめん。
like on the road. We have a guy in charge of this, and it's like, what a job. I know, and he plays, he plays bass guitar as well, so considering he does the two. Smell my socks. Okay, Lewis Nagone here at the Omni. I'm with members of the um, LA Guns. LA right? Guns, thank you. All right. Okay, I'm here with Tracy Guns, Phil Guns, Kelly Guns. How do you feel about what's going on in um, Eastern Europe right now? I don't know what's going on in Eastern Europe. <laughs> Well, they, they broke the wall down, which is great. It's something we never thought would happen in our lifetime. Um, but of course, it all started with Motley Crue. What got you interested in the music business? Girls. Uh, how do you guys feel about people throwing stuff? Right, see you guys later, man. Okay. <laughs> okay. So this last one. Good friends. Good friends. Oh, yeah. Can we say oh, yeah. uh, It's for little kids. Oh. Just, this is just off the top of my head. If life, since we're on this, this metaphysical thing, if life were a mathematical equation, what would the answer be? Zero. Zero? Okay, your new album, Rip and Tear. How, how do you guys feel about Hot Turn Out? Did it come out like you wanted? it? Watch this. Somebody put that out. <laughs> Where do you guys see yourselves going in like the next five years? Ohio. <laughs> We're, watch, we're in Dayton, Ohio. We're in Dayton, Ohio. We Us, watch LA Guns. We 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 LA watch. Guns. Um, what is it we want? I mean, they really no, stink. I mean, they're like, if I can smell them, if you can smell it yourself, then you know you stink. Where do you get these clothes, man? Where are you guys from originally, and where did the band LA Guns originate? Um. That's, that's a hard one. Difficult. <laughs> I don't know. Like LA, yeah. New York, yeah. Chicago. The first two will do. Okay. I don't know. How did the LA band, how did you guys come together as a band? Um, yeah. That's a long story, actually. I, I mean, it, it started happening, I guess. Well, right? we were in the Pet Shop Boys. And well, he was <laughs> in the Pet Shop Boys. There was too many guys <laughs> in the band, so nobody was making any money, so we split up. And... No, that ain't it. This is uh, Sunset Boulevard. This is the uh, tattoo parlor on Sunset Boulevard. The world famous, what's Sunset it called? Strip. Sunset, Sunset. Sunset. Yeah. And we're here. And we've been here before a few times. This one, as you can see, has been here quite a few times. And we're here again. And you may ask why we're here again. And uh, why are we here? Why are we here? It's just too exciting. You don't want to, you can't imagine. If there was somebody asking this question, they'd, they'd ask us uh, what we've been doing, and the answer is we've been recording an album and driving around in extremely borrowed cars, right? Not quite stolen, because you've got to have wheels in LA, you know, and you're so judged upon what you drive. All right, so the album's called Cops and Loaded, and we're getting shit over that already. Like stores, department stores don't want a, a title like that. It's got this killer cover of this uh, chick sitting on a gun. The song's a killer, the production's killer. There ain't nobody gonna come out on an album that's gonna touch this album this year, so forget it.